What are you doing? Just checking out the desk. What are you doing? Why do you have your lip curled at me? Let's go upstairs. Hello, good morning. Happy Tuesday. It is a rainy, gloomy day. I'm just now eating breakfast at like 9 a.m. I just want to show you my little breakfast. Okay, well, just ignore my mess. So I just usually have, on lazy days, Kodiak oatmeal. Either the maple and brown sugar or chocolate chip. Here's the maple brown sugar. I put water in it. I think I put too much water in it. All right, it is super liquidy, but it's fine. Chocolate chips. Let's spice it up. Almond butter. This is like my favorite almond butter. It's from Imperfect Foods and it's like salty. It's so good, like not too salty. And then I'm also gonna put like half a scoop of protein powder just to like add a little, a little something, something. Cause Kodiak is high in protein. Like there's 12 grams of protein in this, but oatmeal isn't super filling all the time. So I feel like adding this extra stuff to it helps. Wait, okay, okay. How much do you wanna bet he's gonna get muddy? I'm using Rule One Cafe Mocha. Feel free to check out my review of this. Okay. It's a little more liquidy than I would like, but it's okay. Today's just like a working day at home. I'm gonna go buy a new laptop sometime this week, I think, because I got that desk so I can get a new laptop. <laughs> and like just feel maybe a new mindset, you know? And you be able to concentrate, which I haven't been able to do much recently. I'm in a kind of like bummy mood, so I'm gonna go. A few minutes later. <sighs> One of those days where I just like can't concentrate. And all I wanna do is go downstairs in the basement and just like relax and sleep and watch movies and cuddle up. Like I just, ugh. You know, do you guys have those days or is it just me? We're just gonna keep going. We're just gonna keep rocking and rolling. Got this. We've got this. Do you ever just have to make yourself a little iced coffee and a fun little glass with a little straw to feel like you're one of those girls? You know those girls. Try and make yourself feel better. I totally forgot. I had a specific reason why I filmed my oatmeal this morning when obviously that's not that exciting of a meal, but it's just to show you that like, I don't know about you, but on my Instagram and stuff, it keeps coming up with all these like super fancy homemade oatmeals people are making. And I definitely want to make some. I tried to make one a couple weeks ago and it made my stomach upset. I think I used the wrong oatmeal or something. I don't know. But anywho, I just want to show you that like you can use oatmeal packets and like just make the most basic boring breakfast if that's just easy and what works for you. You don't have to make some fancy overnight oats or some fancy stove cooked oats or air fryer or anything like that. Like if you're just not feeling it and that's what works for you then like that's fine that's why i want to share that because i know it's hard sometimes seeing on social media people have these like extravagant breakfast routines and morning routines and like today i literally rolled out of bed made that oatmeal and got straight to work i did change from my pjs to a different comfy set of clothes but like that's it you don't have to do anything wild and crazy just remember that the people I was talking about that make the fancy oatmeal and stuff, they're definitely these kind of people, like with the metal straw and the fancy cup. You know, you know what I'm talking about? Except they're probably like a smoothie or like matcha or whatever in here. This is like an iced coffee packet. Like it's not fancy at all. But it makes me feel fancy. The taste, not super fancy, but it's fine. It's fine. Maybe it'll give me energy to make it through my day. All right, people, we made it to five o'clock. It's actually 6.30 now. I worked a little late to make up for my lack of motivation throughout the day. I desperately need to go to the grocery store, but I also just like have so much food in my house at the same time. Like I have a lot of stuff, but it's all like, none of it's a meal. So I'm making a meal out of the little tiny bit I do have that could be a meal. I'm doing this like spinach feta sausage that I make a lot. It's like kind of old, so hopefully it's okay to eat. And then I'm trying Banza pasta. I've seen it all over the, you know, TikTok and Instagram. And here it's good, so we're gonna try it out. It gives you more protein than typical pasta. I don't know. This is the only sauce I really have, so like RIP to my stomach probably, but we're gonna try it. And then the only like veggies I really have are stir fry frozen veggies. And I feel like that's just like not the vibe with this meal. And then I have spinach, but there's spinach in the pasta sauce and in the sausage. So I'm like, do I add more spinach? 
Is that too much spinach? I don't know. But I also know when you make spinach, it like wilts up so much. It's like maybe I should just do it. Add some extra um, fiber or whatever. I don't know. That's what I'm doing. And then I'm going to go downstairs and figure out what I want to get from the grocery tomorrow. And work on a video or something. I don't, I don't know. know. Ross might come over today. But yeah, I just need to cook something because I've eaten out for like every meal since Friday and it's Tuesday. So that's a little gross. Stay tuned to see what I decide to do on this very exciting day of my life. <laughs> Here's the final product. I put some extra little spinach things in there. Just some, not a lot though. All right, let's see how it tastes. Ooh, it's a little foggy there. Was it worth it for the shot? I'm gonna go with probably not. All right, let's see how it tastes. All right. So, sorry about the slider. Let's try it out. This is my first time trying the Banza pasta. So let's just try it kind of alone. It's good. It tastes like normal pasta. It's like a little thicker, maybe. Yeah, I mean, it's a good meal. I'm gonna eat and watch some YouTube. I was about to lay down on this couch and watch an episode of uh, Married at First Sight <laughs> before doing anything productive. And then I realized I haven't done anything active all day. So I'm going to watch the episode still. But I'm gonna do it on my bike back there and hopefully that'll get the blood flowing and make me more productive. We'll see. I'm just trying to slowly get into the workout routine because usually I go like zero to 100 and I work out way too much, way too hard, and then I get hurt or something happens. So I'm just gonna take it slow. I'll bike a little, and then if I feel like doing more, I will, and if I don't, I won't. Simple as that. Here we go. I feel bad because I want him to get energy out and cardio in, but it's like so gross out. I can't do it. I can't do it, I'm sorry. I'm a bad pet mom. Just kidding. It's also like pitch black out, so I can't really walk alone. Love being a girl. <laughs> I took away his toy and now he's sad. That really? That was lame. You're better than that. Take another lap. Do you like my desk? I do like your desk. Very nice. I'm gonna work from it. I figured. Oh yeah, watch this. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> Brutus, why are you sitting like that? Do you wanna compete with me, Brutus? No. He's like, no, I'm good. Oh, fine. He's exhausted. Ooh. How is it? <laughs> no freaking good. You're gonna eat your half, or? How can you move your arm? <laughs> I'm trying to show Brutus. No, up. <laughs> yeah, so I'm gonna eat my half. This is nothing but cake snickerdoodle. Ross's favorite. So mean. Ross is offended that I said the snickerdoodle was his favorite. I'm not a simple man. Okay, what kind of ice cream do you try to order on our first date? This best ice cream. What was it? Chocolate. And then what I get? He copied me. He got what I got, which is like the. And why did I do that? Because you got nervous. Because you didn't I, want to seem boring. Because I panicked and didn't know any other ice cream, so I just got whatever you got. I said, At Cold Stone. Cold Stone. He was gonna get just chocolate. Hold on, chocolate with like Kit Kats in it or something. Oh well, you've never said that part. Yeah, because he said what ice cream do you want. I said chocolate, and you said that's boring. Yeah. And I was like, well, I didn't get to the goods yet. <laughs> I judged you too soon. So the influencer that usually does surveys or whatever, mm -hmm. she had people putting in like their icks for people, like when they were dating, you know? Yeah. What made them get the ick? Uh -huh. And one of them was that they only ever ate like vanilla ice cream or something. Well, yeah, vanilla is boring. It reminded me of you. Oh! <laughs> you had to tell me this horrible news, but also give me the greatest cake I've ever had. Yes. I see how you work. Come on, do you? There you go. I showed him eating the cake. So here's me eating the cake. Cheers. You eat all that? Mm-hmm. <laughs> For sure. Bruce is curling his lip at us. 